Good old times for immortals out there, and welcome back to Infinity Complex Palace of the Immortals. I am Chris. <laughs> oh yeah, right. Why am I waiting for everybody else to talk? I am Chris. I am uh, trying to do some stuff today with a little new series that GameG, uh helped me name called uh, Color Me Impressed. Unimpressed, sorry. Uh, where... I like to do things. I'm going to leave the other video. It's another explanation. There's one. Just go look at it. This is another attempt to get that video going properly. So just just go look at the other video so that you can figure out what I'm doing. And then you can see why I'm crazy and why it didn't work. What is going but on? for now, I'm just going to go ahead and paint this guy. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and go back over the colors. This is a dry piranha plant from the Super Mario series. And yeah, I got it, I don't know how long ago. I'm going to be using this to paint its main body. So this is a skeleton bone and desert yellow. I'm gonna mix the two together. I've already got a drop of the skeleton bone here from the last failed know if episode. If it's my YouTube or if it's you or what, but I can't get it to load right. That's not right. It should have the video like up on the top. This is the one right here though. Cause if I get right here and I do yeah, this. No, I know it's the right one, but it should have the video up in the top and then it should have the comment section. There's the video in the comments. No, not like that. Like the, like different, like completely different is how my YouTube is normally set up. Okay. Whoa. Like if you go to the last video, it should be a completely different setup, which is what I'm used to. There we go. Thank I don't know. The other one was nicer. Hi, I'm back. It's all good. I can see it. I figured out how to sit, so because as it turns out, I had to put it all back on the other side. I figured out how to sit. Aw, oh, the desert yellow is stuck. Thankfully, I have some paper clips to clean that out. Alright, I'm posting your other video. Alright, and then I'm going to take this little guy here. Hmm, before I put it on. Yeah, that works. How did you get the video right? Oh, whatever, I'll do it. If I make a mess in these, does it matter? I could actually use this whole color as primer. If I make a mess with it, doesn't matter. one that you've painted? Toy? A little toy like this? Not... No, I've painted... I painted a raptor once, but I lost the raptor. I painted a, other little toys, too, that I lost over time. But this is the first one we've done on the channel. This is the first one I've done on the channel, yeah. You can't hear my music through my headset, can you? What? You can't hear, and if you turn the video all the way up, you can't hear my music through that head being Hang picked on, up. Find out. Gotta lift up that chin there. Oh, 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 come on. Gonna get a little pain on my hand here. We'll come back and apply more later. For now, it should be sufficient. Uh, Fifth Row says he can hear the music, but I can't hear it. Uh, Fifth Row says oh, he... Sorry. I turned it down. I'm hoping I don't get in trouble. I couldn't hear it. I had you turned cranked all the way up. I couldn't hear any music. Oh, 
No, he said I can't hear it. Oh, okay. Well, you should be good now that you've turned it down for sure. <laughs> All right, I'm already running out of paint because I didn't use much. But one of the things, damn it. One of the things that you don't want to do is use too much paint at once because you will probably end up losing some of it. But you also don't want to make too little or make too complicated a mixture if you do make too little. Because if you don't get the right distribution of colors again, you won't get the same color this time around. Fithra says it looks good so far. Thank you. And the fact that the paint is not applying smoothly is going to add texture to the paint itself and add texture to well, it's going to add texture to the bone. No, it won't be moldy. It'll be pitted and bumpy. I don't have any mold. You know, I could put like mold bones. in it. I could actually apply. You have grass. You have grass for D&D &D models. I could put the grass in the holes in his head. Yeah, or you could put it in the pot. Or I could put it in the pot. It's not a pot, though. It's a warp pipe. Oh, yeah, you're right. Damn it, you almost confused me. Well, it looks like he's a potted plant. He does look like a potted plant, but he's in a warp pipe. Okay, then put the moss in the holes. That's, that's moss, though. Gamgee was saying mold. Yeah, you don't have mold. mold. Well, mold would just be adding some black splotches. Really. I don't know. Have you seen it? There you go. Alright. I think I've got the entire head pretty well covered. That is a new version of a chomper. It looks good. It looks like a different version. Huh? I don't know if that's what you're going for, but I like seeing different versions of stuff. Who is this? Bithero. Okay. He's trying to make, it, it's supposed to be a desert PD Piranha, right? No. It's just a skeletal PD Piranha? So the deal is, is that I'm going to end up having to paint the inside of the warp pipe. Um, the deal is, is that I don't think gray is the right color for bone. And if I do the, the gray for the, if I over, if I redo the color for the gray, I have to redo everything. Yeah. So I want him to be more skeletal looking with the right coloring than not. So I'm not going gray. I'm, or I'm getting rid of the gray. Because gray is not right. I'm making it more accurately colored. If that, Makes more as sense. As accurate as a mythical plant can be. Well, yeah, as accurate as a mythical plant can be. But just a more true version. More true to color. But I if this if this does really well, I if like if you guys do like this, this gets a lot of views, a lot of comments or whatever. 
Like if this does really well, I'm gonna do more of these. I'm just gonna go, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just go to the store, <clears throat> buy a little grab toy like this, unbox it for you guys and paint it right then and there. All right, so that looks pretty good. I actually don't think I'm gonna need to do too much in terms of putting new layers on and it's already drying pretty well. In my opinion, I like seeing people to make stuff and like draw stuff. Shit, I don't have a napkin or a paper towel. Oh wait, I got this. It's one of the reasons I stopped painting. <laughs> I needed paper towels to clean my brush on. And it's so expensive to get paper towels yeah. all the time. Pithro said, so I think that is cool. <laughs> 